The annual Meriden Threshing Show is happening this weekend, and here to tell us more about it is Merlin Mahoney with the Meriden Antique Engine and Threshers Association. Merlin, good morning. Thanks, Thanks. for being with us today. Thank you, Aaron, for having us on today. I'm Help. glad so that we can promote our show this weekend. Rain or shine, by Rain the way. Rain or shine. Well, tell us, what are a few of the, the highlights for this year? You know, the biggest highlights are going to be the crawler tractors that we are featuring this year that, that uh, are already starting to line up on the showgrounds today. And of course, in our other feature tractor is the uh, uh, threshing of wheat that we have bundled uh, so that we can get the grain out of the heads. And we'll have three antique threshing machines going and two of them will be with tractors and one will be with a steam engine. So if you haven't seen steam engines working for quite some time, come on on out. Of course, the other features we have is we have a dance on Friday night and we have a dance on, on uh, uh, Saturday night also. Friday night's uh, the uh, uh, midnight special and then Sierra on Saturday night. Now, uh, we also have antique tractor pull uh, on Saturday. That'll be on the track, and then uh, all three days we'll, we'll have garden tractor pulls, so that's a feature also. Um, then we're also featuring um, small engines. There'll be small engines all over the place. Yeah. And Minneapolis Moline's uh, will be another featured, will be our featured big tractors this year. Also, there's plenty of food at the uh, Cook Shack, um, and then the, with homemade ice cream if you want, and homemade pies. And uh, there will be flea markets around the ground so that you can um, shop and uh, browse at that, plus all the static displays from oh, yeah. the, uh, the uh, mill, the flour mill, the blacksmith shop, the Sims garage, the uh, wheelwright building. Uh, we'll also be sewing lumber. Making, wow. <laughs> taking, and then uh, the general store will have uh, penny candy sometimes that we're used to be able to reach into the jars and pick it out. Yeah. We'll also have that. And Lots then of course of the log cabins open also. And then uh, Sunday we'll in the Bloomfield Church we'll have church services at 9 o'clock. Non-denominational if you want to come up. Well it sounds like a full weekend and you know I, I can remember going to this event with my dad as a kid. So obviously it's been going on for many many years. What do you think makes it such a timeless event? I think it's a fact that uh, people like to see what their ancestors had to go through to survive and uh, and make a living on on farming and uh, what it took to just get through one day and the hard labor. It's uh, there, there's no computers involved here. It's all <laughs> physical sweat and uh, we'll also have stationary bailing, which is also uh, quite strenuous. Also. The, uh, the other thing that we have is we, uh, we have uh, uh, a, a playground for the children so that they can be entertained. And we have a little um, merry-go-round. Oh, how fun. That thing runs um, uh, 24 hours a day for three days. Wow. Kids just love it because they just don't get to use that any place yeah, else. Yeah, I bet. And the other thing we have for children um, on uh, Saturday afternoon, uh, the clown will show up and we'll have a pedal 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 pool, blah, blah, blah. that's kind of hard for me to say this morning, <laughs> or um, we will give prizes and everybody gets a prize and we'll class it by age so that there's no dominance of one person over the other. And I think what they give out is free ice cream Ooh, at the Cook Shack. So, can't beat that. Yeah, yeah, it's homemade right there too. Sounds delicious. Well, we just have a few seconds left, but I want to make sure people know how to get tickets. It's a mile east of Meriden, Kansas on K4 Highway. It costs you six dollars to get in, and if when you get in, well, just drop it all over the place. You'll get a button, and that button will get you in all three days. Veterans get in free. All right. So if you're Wonderful. a vet, come on in. We'll just push you right on by the gate. Well, the Meriden Threshing Show is happening this weekend in Meriden, like he said, just right off K4 Highway. Merlin, thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you very much.